Here goes. I know one false move could be catastrophic, and when I stop, the plane could topple and shatter. The wings are curving as planned. The curves needed to reduce the amount of roll and their holding, but my steering and my speed just aren't good enough. No flights. Not this time. I didn't really give it full power because I was a bit disconcerted by the way the aircraft was leaning and I was trying to get the hang of the controls. We're going to go again. Hopefully I'll feel confident of paddling a bit harder. I give it loads more welly this time. But it's still not enough and all I can think about is saving those wings for another attempt. I just pedalled as fast as I could. Tried to keep the plane steady. Uh, it, it was running out and I jumped off so that I didn't damage the plane. Um, didn't quite manage to pull that off. It's a reminder how fragile this thing is, but at least there's no major damage. Next time, I'll have the courage to cling on when it stops and hope that the wings can take my weight. But for now, it's back to the hangar to rebuild my broken plane and reflect on my efforts so far. Until I get to a certain speed, about 12 or 13 miles an hour, my control surfaces, my tail and my rudder, don't do very much. There's not enough wind going over them for them to work particularly well, so I've got very little control over the aeroplane at low speed. Consequently, it starts leaning and there's precious little I can do about it. Right, power in now. There's only an hour or so left before the airfield opens, but the good news is the wind is picking up. The headwind helps and, right, go. I don't know, maybe a more experienced pilot would be uh, soaring over the treetops at this point. If I put everything into this now, I hope I'll get the control I need. With each run, I get faster and faster. OK, I'm good to go. Three, two, one. Here we go, Jen. Honestly, when you first go up like that, you have no idea what to do. It's just like, oh my god, I've left the ground. And uh, now I just want to stay off the ground. It's amazing, absolutely amazing. <laughs> I'm going to go and do it again. I feel the more I do this, the better I'll get. But there's only enough time for one last okay. attempt before the runway opens. just flown a bicycle and completely like under human power the ground just disappeared and then I didn't really know what to do apparently the Wright brothers first flight was about 12 seconds I'm getting around about the right ballpark it flies a man can fly an average man can fly not a pilot, not an athlete, a normal bloke can actually fly. <laughs>